why he might look like at first glance a tourist who has come to Vietnam for the first time. But in fact, this guy is anything but a new arrival. He has been here before, and the purpose of the visit is definitely not sightseeing. The connection with some of the people in the city has brought him back here for something he has been deeply in love with, music. I uh, DJ and produce music by Unconventional Science. Uh, I'm a beat maker, a DJ, a uh, record collector. I've been uh, active in music for the last uh, 15 years. And uh, yeah, just living in Hanoi now, making, making music. Unconventional Science, aka Nick Everett, is a producer and DJ hailing from Los Angeles. Being an experienced DJ with 15 years on the scene across America, his eclectic set seeks to push the boundaries of what DJing can be, while at the same time keeping the party moving. His love of diverse musical styles pushes him to mix and blend genres in ways that just oppose different eras as well as tie together the universal rhythms of music. With years following a passion for creating new music, Nick has traveled to many places around the world. People, landscapes, and the new experiences provide him with inspiration for new music. And his use of video he has shot also illustrates the music he has created. Having gotten to know Vietnamese musicians mainly through social networks, music websites, and rare joint performances, Dalat Born Bushlam is the first person he sought out. And his journey with Bushlam and other members of the Sub Elements Grove in Vietnam begins. Born and grown up in Dalat, this young musician traveled to Ho Chi Minh City but finally decided to move to Hanoi and formed the sub-elements group of DJs, producers and selectors focusing on low frequency and sub-bass music. Lý do em lập lên sub-elements là tại vì em thích nhạc, thích bass, thích nhạc nhiều bass thì em lập ra để mọi người mà có cùng sở thích với em mình có chỗ để mà mình giao lưu và đồng thời là đem cái dòng nhạc mình thích ra ngoài cho nhiều người biết. Sub Element được thành lập sau 7 tháng gì đấy thôi. Nhưng mà từ bây giờ so với hồi mới lập thì phát triển lớn hơn rất nhiều. À, lúc mới thành lập thì chỉ có em và JC và Tùng và Quân thì bốn người. Còn sau này thì có cả Nick, cả TJ, cả rất nhiều người thì mỗi người một việc thì thì thì, thì mình gom góp mình 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 làm cho sub em mình sẽ phát triển mạnh hơn thôi. There are already a number of DJ groups in town, but the sub elements aims to be different mainly due to the focus on unique and creative criteria. Biết nhau là qua qua DJ thôi em tại thôi anh tại vì bọn em là DJ cũng lâu lắm rồi. Thì những những DJ mà có cái có cái hồ tí truyền tải được cái cảm xúc của mình qua cái set thì bọn em collect rồi bọn em tập trung vào rồi quen biết nhau thì giao lưu thì thì mới lập ra cái này còn những cái bạn mà mà DJ nước ngoài họ biết đến tụi em là tại vì 
tụi em qua mạng là nhiều qua internet là nhiều thì uh, họ biết đến tụi em tại vì họ có cái chung cái cái chung cái nền tảng là 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 nhà bass thì uh, họ đến hà nội thì chỉ có bọn em thôi thì qua rất nhiều uh, mối quan hệ của tụi em nữa thì thì, thì có có mời các bạn để đến chơi Since coming to Vietnam, Nick became a regular visitor to Bush apartment. I met Bush uh, last year when I was touring Asia, playing uh, music to support my album I released. And uh, we played a show at Hanoi Rock City. It was me, Demon Slayer, and uh, Bush, Slow Low. And it was a, I don't know, it was a really good show. So basically, I wanted to come back because, uh, I don't know, I love the music scene here. I feel like it's really... Uh, emerging it's like something really good is is happening and uh so bush was uh you know the guy who, who lived here and uh he was always doing sick music and i really wanted to connect with him so uh before i even came i made sure to like contact him a lot and we were really excited to, to do whatever we could do so once i got here we got uh, we hit the ground running and i uh, started throwing shows and uh it's been really uh I don't know. It's been really good so far, so I'm I'm happy. And uh, everybody else in the crew, I kind of just met through Bush, JC and uh, Tongdo, and uh, I don't know. Everybody's really talented, so it's cool to have a group of people that uh, push me and uh, make me feel like I need to really stay on top of what I'm doing. Every time they meet, their talk focuses on music. That's when they exchange new tracks they've heard, play their latest mix and help each other improve their own productions. I think it's exciting like uh like working with Bush and like trying to build a community. It's like when you have artists who are like really interesting and like good artists who are not getting the the proper, you know, shine, you know, the proper exposure, then it, it's good to be a part of like developing a community that grows together so that I mean a lot of the time there's 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 music everywhere, there's DJs everywhere, but often it's really uh like a hierarchy and there's like really a power struggle. So it's for me it's always really rewarding to like join, you know, the good guys and kind of like push against what we view as something that's it's kind of negative and uh, cheap. Like it kind of uh people who DJ here a lot of people um I think don't really have so much passion in what they do. It's a lot more like okay, we'll make everyone dance, we'll play whatever anybody wants, but we're trying to be more creative and it's harder, but I think like uh working together and when we build this community everybody even the people who show up for the shows are going to feel proud that they were part of this and that like when everything is really beautiful with what we're doing like uh i think everyone's going to be happy as music is the central focus of his time in vietnam mick immediately joins the group at different music events Nick hopes his presence brings something new to the music scene, which has rapidly developed in recent years. I really enjoy the music scene. It's a, uh, it's cool to see things developing here. It's like uh, kind of starting up a lot, which is uh, a lot more exciting to me than uh, being in Europe or America, because there's something new happening and it feels uh, exciting when you're making the music. So we've been uh, throwing more and more shows. We just had a show at Mix Club. It was a really big show. We flew in some artists from uh, Malaysia that were uh, friends of mine. And uh, it was really good, so it's uh, it's nice to play good music and have a good time doing it. With the new beats and genres, and the skills of our talented DJ, Nick has, together with his friends, succeed in driving the crowd wild everywhere they come. nhạc kiểu nhiều nhiều bass cho nhiều ông trầm nó tác động đến 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 bản thân em nhiều hơn là bởi vì ngay cả cái nhịp bass nó nó đập dội vào tường nó vào người mình lúc mà mình cảm nhận hơn về âm nhạc hiện trên còn tư thể luôn cá nhân em được nghe nick khoảng hai ba lần 
lần nào cũng tuyệt vời cứ sở ra gà cũng nhảy hết cỡ có thể em thì không bỏ lỡ hôm buổi nào của nhóm sub element thường thì em em thích ở sau đây mình là cái dòng nhạc họ đang chơi rất là hay và rất là đánh, nó có chiều sâu nó khác với cả những cái loại nhạc hiện nay trong tất cả loại nhạc điện tử <cười> Since the founding day, Sub Elements has been joined by many young and talented DJs and music producers, both locals and foreigners. And the appearance of Nick in the group is really appreciated by other members. Nick is a producer and a DJ rất giàu kinh nghiệm và kỹ thuật mix của Nick rất ghê gớm phải nói là như vậy những những cái nhạc và những cái cách nick mix, mix nhạc khác với những dj khác và đó là cái điều mà tạo tạo nên cái sự thú vị cho khi, khi mà người ta nghe nhạc của nick nick average is amazing man the thing i respect from him is he's willing he's willing to travel around the world and like giving his stuff giving his produ uh, his giving his production like door to door like i mean like knocking on somebody's door and giving his production that i respect that i respect that approach you know uh, that that's my respect for him and his production is sick man it's, it's, it's good music and nick seems to be happy with his performances here people end up really responding well to it so it's not like some musical scenes where you have to play like trance music because that's all people understand all they know all they can dance to. Here it's like if the energy is good, people are having a good time and uh, that's good, that's what you want, you know. Just by being busy with his music projects here in Hanoi and continuing to produce tracks for artists back home, it doesn't mean that Nick has no time for himself. Sometimes, Bush helps Nick experience some of local life. That includes enjoying some local street food. Here it's like uh, the public life is uh, there's so much of it. It's really good to be out and like uh, around. Every day I'm eating Vietnamese food. It's, uh, it's part of why I'm here. I love Vietnamese food. So I don't know, finding good spots on the street and uh, anywhere. I feel uh, it's not really too fatty or anything like that. So I mean, it's, it's good. Um, I enjoy the flavors a lot. Having been around the world, Nick is quite familiar with street life, and that's why this easy-going guy doesn't mind having some local beer on the pavement. I like Bia Hoi. Um, yeah, anywhere. I mean, there's so many, but it's cool uh, to go there, and everybody's just kind of having a good time, and uh, it's cool to meet people and kind of see what uh, see what it's like, you know. While originally not knowing much about this land. Vietnam now means something to this American man. Vietnam's a really kind of chaotic place. It's really active and lively and uh, there's uh, a million things happening at once. And uh, there's always some new food to try or uh, some new experience to have. So I, I feel like Vietnam is just like a great place if you really like to be like stimulated. Like if you want to be uh, excited, if you're an active person, it's like a really nice place to just go experience a million things.